All right, in this video, we're going to show you how to build packages with Colcon. Before we jump into the main topic of this video, if you're new to my channel, this channel is all about robotics, controls, machine learning, and computer vision, so subscribe to learn more. I have a bunch of playlists on computer vision, software, mechanical. This one's on OpenCV, ROS2, Python, C++, Git, mechanical design, SOLIDWORKS, and here's my GitHub that goes along with it. So let's jump back into the topic of this video. So a package contains your source, your cmakelist.txt, your headers, and package.xml, which has your meta info for your ROS programs. And Colkin is a tool that's gonna, um, that we're going to use to build our package. So first off, you want to run this command here to install your Colkin. I've already done that. And then you can make your workspace and navigate to your workspace. So go ahead and do that. I already made my workspace, so I will just navigate to my workspace. And then what you want to do is you want to add some source code to your folder. So you're going to get clone from here some ROS tutorials. So I've already done this step, but just do that. And then what you want to do next is set up the Colcon tab completion. So you could do echo and then insert this uh, autocomplete command here, and then this will get your Colcon tab completion up and running. So here we're going to do the build uh, step. So what we're going to do is run Colcon build symlink install. So here is, it allows us to install and the symlink, what that does is it's going to um, prevent copying the files and just make a symlink to your files. Okay, so let's go ahead and build our uh, package. So we do Colcon build and then dash dash sim. Okay, so I just hit tab and the autocomplete is working. So this will go ahead and build it. Okay, so the build took 21 seconds and then after it's done building, what we wanna do is do ls and we could see the contents of this folder. So you could see that we have a build, install and log folder. The next step is to source your folder. So we want to run this command, uh, source, install, local setup.bash and this will allow us to run some of the packages that we just uh, built. So here we do ROS2 run turtle sim and then tur turtle sim node. So this will be our turtle sim node up and running. And you may think that this might be the same one as the original turtle sim. So let's do some modifications so you can see that it's actually different. Okay, so let's go ahead and find our um, file that has the name of our turtle sim. So inside our turtle frame, you could hit control P and search for the turtle frame file. And then after you do that, you could come in here and we could just add in my name, Kevin. So what this will do is if we go back to our read. Okay, so here we edited that and then we just want to redo our build step. So I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, copy this again. So I'm going to rebuild it and then source it. And after it's done building, we could go ahead and run our turtle sim node again. So now that I have this up and running, you notice that the name has changed to Kevin. So that proves that we are editing our local turtle sim. Okay. So in my next video, I'm going to show you how to create your own package. So go check that out. If you found this video helpful, give a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.